What's up guys, Jake here. Today we're back on the Chattahoochee River located in Columbus, Georgia. And today we're actually at a place called the Lazy River and we're gonna be metal detecting and scuba diving for a missing Rolex, potentially worth up to $15,000. I met a scuba diver yesterday and he told me a story about how he tried searching for this missing Rolex about a year ago. He didn't get lucky, but he recommended me to get out there and give it a shot. So today I have the tools I need to hopefully find that missing Rolex. But that said, if you guys wanna see more metal detecting videos like this in the future, drop a thumbs up on this video. If there's support, I'll come back out to this location to see what else I can find with a metal detector. So let's go ahead and grab the scuba tank, put it on our back, dive on out there and hopefully find some good stuff with the metal detector. Girl. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> 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 so 
so it's been a few hours and I haven't got lucky enough to find that missing Rolex and to be honest with you guys it's gonna be very slim to none chances to be able to locate that missing Rolex but I did get lucky find some money you know like some coins some other cool things like that but I'm gonna keep at it man and hopefully find it but uh, you know, I am having a lot of fun, but it does wear you out just sitting here trying to cover as much ground as possible because the spot he told me wasn't very precise. It's like really broad. So I have a lot of area to cover, pretty much like five football fields. But let's go ahead and get back underneath the water and maybe we'll get lucky. Oh no, I just found broken Ray Bans. Dang. Oh my goodness, I found an old phone, it's like one of those that you type on, <laughs> that's funny. All right, so we just got done scuba diving and metal detecting underwater. Found some cool stuff, but nothing super, super crazy. But we did come across a watch. So let me show you guys the watch real quick. So this is the watch I found today. It's definitely not the Rolex, but when I found it, man, since I was searching for the Rolex, I freaked out. I thought it was the Rolex. I thought, it, I mean, it looks gold with diamonds potentially underwater. It was just so shiny. But uh, yeah, I mean, I was a little heartbroken to be honest with you guys. I'm not too sure of the name brand. If you guys know what it is, let me know in the comment section below. It still could be a pretty expensive watch. I'm not too sure, but I know for sure it isn't the Rolex I was searching for. So that missing $15,000 Rolex is still out there in the river. Hopefully I can get lucky enough to find that. But it was pretty cool that we did come across a missing watch out there. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, make sure you guys leave this video a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new. We're closing in on 10 million subscribers. I'd love to be able to break that milestone. Also, if you already subscribed, make sure you guys hit that notification button so you guys don't miss my next adventure. But with us, Said, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all next time.